Fact Family Triangles with Missing Facts, 2.11b. This is part two of 2.11. Now, as we talked about in the previous video, we can use Fact Family Triangles to help us add or subtract. And sometimes you'll see the triangles with a little dot on the top, and that tells us that that's the sum, or in subtraction, that's the minuend. And then we've got the two numbers down here in each corner. You might see a plus and a minus in the middle here that are separated with a comma. You might see the triangle looking like this. This is still our sum or our minuend, and these are either our add-ins or the subtrahend and the difference. The top number is the sum for an addition fact family triangle, or it's the minuend for a subtraction fact family triangle. And for 7, 6, and 13, these are our fact families. We have two addition sentences and two subtraction sentences. 7 plus 6 is 13, or 6 plus 7 is 13. We can switch places with them, can't we? The commutative property tells us we can do that. We can also have 13 minus 6 equals 7, or 13 minus 7 equals 6. Well, sometimes when you're using these triangles, your homework or the book will have some missing facts. We can use a fact family to help us fill in that missing number. We have a 13 and an 8, so we know we're going to have two addition sentences and two subtraction sentences. When we look at the subtraction sentence here, we can answer 13 minus 8. We can use a counting down method, can't we? From the 13, we say 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8. That's 5. So 13 minus 8 equals 5. We know that the missing fact must be a 5. And that means 13 minus 5 equals 8, doesn't it? And it also means that 8 plus 5 equals 13, and 5 plus 8 equals 13. We can put our 5 in here. So by writing the fact families with the missing number, we can solve one of them and fill in the triangle and complete our triangle. Let's try another one. We have a 15 and a missing fact and a 9. We know there's going to be two addition number sentences, and two subtraction number sentences. When we look at this one, we can just answer this one, can't we? 15 minus 9. So we start at the 15, and we can count back. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9. That was a 6. So we know 15 minus 9 is 6. We know our missing fact for this triangle is a 6. We can fill in all the other numbers, can't we? We know the missing one is a 6. 6 plus 9 equals 15. 9 plus 6 equals 15. 15 minus 9 equals 6, and 15 minus 6 equals 9. We can even check to make sure we're right. We can do the addition ones to make sure we're right. We can count on from the 9, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Yeah, it was 6. So we know we got it right. So you can fill in the missing corner of a fact family triangle by writing out the fact family two addition and two subtraction sentences and then answering the number sentence that looks the easiest to answer. Okay? I'll see you next video. Bye.